Yo, what up? This is a guide on how to do every single shortcut in Mario Kart 8 Deluxe with an inside drift bike. This video will not cover easy corner cuts or grass shortcuts. The most optimal bike is on the right. What I use is on the left because I think rollers look stupid and I don't like using them. That doesn't matter. First off, Mario Kart Stadium. Just take this turn tight like normal and then hold a very shallow drift through the straightaway. Hold your drift off the ramp and it will automatically release your mini turbo. Make sure you hold down the entire time while you're in the air so you can clear all of the off-road. If your drift is too tight, you can actually still make it if you hit the wall. Now onto the hardest shortcut in the entire game, the Shy Guy Falls cut at the end, Shroomless. Don't ever do it without a mushroom, but you can do it, you'll lose if you do it because you won't make it. But you want to be going as far left into the cut as possible, and you want to jump before the grass at the highest point of the road. Once you land, you need to do two very quick hops onto the ramp, and you should be able to have enough speed to get a trick. I don't think this shortcut is possible with just one mushroom like it is with carts. However, it is possible with two mushrooms. Pull down off the ramp and start holding left to go into the cave. Once you land, use your mushroom and then hop right as you hit the water so you can clear the rest of the off-road. The Dragon Driftway gap cut is not possible shroomless with an inside drift bike, so instead, jump into the off-road, then use your mushroom, jump over the ramp, and then jump over the gap. On GBA Mario Circuit, build an orange mini turbo on this turn, then jump into the grass with a left drift. Keep your drift until you go in between these two trees, hop onto the glider ramp. Once you're in the air, you need to align yourself so you're going straight onto the blocks. The shortcut can be pretty tricky, so now onto two of the easiest shortcuts in the game. Royal Raceway and Tokyo Blur have the exact same shortcut. Just build a mini turbo and jump right before you hit the grass and you make it every time. Next up, Music Park. Start off wide and then brake drift in, so you get a very tight angle. Release your mini turbo once you hit the drum, and that's literally it. On Grumble Volcano, you want to enter the off-road right here, then hold a shallow drift, and then jump right when you get to the edge. As for the second shortcut, you just want to do a hard drift off of the ramp, it's pretty easy. On Ice Ice Outpost, you want to enter the shortcut as if you're going straight off of the ramps. Release your mini turbo right when you hit the first ramp, and right before you go off this green part, tilt right a little bit so you don't fly off. And the ending cut is the exact same thing, just go a little wide, and then just go straight off the ramps. There are two ways to do the Hyrule Circuit shortcut. First way, drift after you land and then go in between the two trees. Or you can drift as you land and hold a very shallow drift and release your mini turbo and jump in between the tree and the wall. Ribbon Road can be a little bit tricky because of how the road works, but I go for a straight alignment off of this star onto the blocks. I drift as I land, then I drift off the track right to the left of this star. If you just want to do the second part, you can trick off the left side of the road and it gives you a great alignment into the shortcut. The big blue lane switch. Do a hard left drift right before this boost panel, then align yourself with the right drift, and then do another hard left drift right off this boost panel. The ramp shortcut on Toad Circuit, I'm not sure if it's fast or shroomless because you actually just hit so much off-road, but the ending cut is just like Luigi Circuit from Mario Kart Wii. You want to drift into the shortcut and jump into the off-road, then use your mushroom. You want to do a hard left drift right before you pass this pipe, so you're drifting into the grass. If you start your drift too late, you'll hit this coping and you'll go flying across the track. To make the Sydney Sprint shortcut with one mushroom, you want to drift before the bench and to the right of those two rocks. For the shortcut before the glider, jump with your mini turbo into the grass and use your mushroom as you land and drift tight into the glider ramp. Ninja Hideaway. I trick off the center of this ramp, do a pretty shallow drift, and then do a tight drift right before I'm going to go off the track and I hold this tight drift and then release my mini turbo just before I hit the door frame and you'll go right through the piranha plant. Snowland, hard drift before the snowman and jump. You don't even have to jump, it's that easy. Mushroom Gorge gap jump. Hold down every time you trick off these mushrooms because it lets you consistently skip this last mushroom. When you're drifting you want to align yourself so that you're cutting off as much as possible. Then use your mushroom and hop off of the grass. I recommend having two mushrooms for the shortcut because the landing is very inconsistent and you usually end up going off-road. GBA Boo Lake. I drift off this ramp so that I can build an orange mini turbo and release it right as you land so you can go through the cardboard bush. 
the DK Summit Double is exactly how you do it in Wii. Start wide and cancel your drift. Do a left drift over the first gap and continue that over the second gap. You might want a mushroom for this cut because the landing is very slow. DS Mario Circuit, start wide and use your mushroom really early into a very tight drift. If you use your mushroom too late, you'll have too much boost and fly across the track. Koopa Cape, start a hard drift off the second boost panel and use your mushroom once you hit the waterfall. Boom. Vancouver Velocity, jump into the off-road, then use your mushroom and do a shallow drift onto the glider ramp. DK Mountain, I am doing a hard right drift and brake drifting the whole time with my pink mini turbo boost. Release your second pink mini turbo into the grass while you're brake drifting. Front of Plant Cove has these three underwater off-road cuts. They're pretty easy, just hold down during them and cut off all the off-road. And there it is! Every shortcut with an inside drift bike in Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. If I missed any or there's better ways to actually do some of these shortcuts, please feel free to let me know in the comments. And like the video if you liked it. See ya!